You can hear it sizzling over here. Here is a great recipe for grilling, and it's perfect for when the temperatures warm up and you're looking for something a little lighter. Willie Bryan is here from Firebirds Wood Fire Grill, and he's got a great recipe for us today. Good to have you with us right now. And, and again, as folks are getting ready for swimsuit season and just looking for something a little lighter, this is a fantastic recipe. I think it is. Yeah, the Mahi Veracruz, uh, the whole plate is 580 calories. Uh -huh. uh, so it's a great seasonal item going into the summer. So all of our items that we're producing right now for a summer feature right now, all under 580 calories, all very light. Okay. And just perfect for this time of the season. All right. So right now you've got shrimp on the grill. Got the shrimp going. Going to get started with the uh, Mahi. Okay. That started. I'm going to add a little bit of. Um, a citrus seasoning to it as well too. Mm -hmm. Bring out some of the natural flavors of that food. Okay. Now you're using mahi with this, but would this work with any other type of fish, or if you your can, suggestion one? You can certainly use it with uh, multiple types of fish. Uh, the mahi veracruz sauce that we're going to be putting into uh -huh. it as well works really well with the mahi itself. Okay. Uh, so this is how we are preparing it at yeah. the restaurant, but you can certainly try it. As much as you have, uh, you know, you'd like to try it at uh, any other dishes that you might have as okay. well too. Okay, all right, super. So, but we're going along with the shrimp. It doesn't take very long on that shrimp. Mm-hmm. Pretty close to being ready. Mahi is a great fish. It's a great uh, fish for grilling. And uh, at Farber's, uh, we actually use a wood-fired grill okay. uh, as well, which is kind of the highlight of, our, of the kitchen. Yeah. Uh, we cook a lot of our all of our steaks, our hamburgers, and all of our fish, of course. Uh, to go with a great menu as far as salads and the sandwiches and burgers. Mm -hmm. So it's a very good mix on the menu, and we're excited about having this new feature that we've got going here. Okay, super. Moving it up here pretty good. Mm -hmm. Drain a little bit of this oil. Okay. Off. All right, fish still looking good on this side and everything. So, have uh, you been out to the restaurant? I have not. I got to get to your, your side of town a bit more often. So, yes, but I, I hear some nice things about it. Well, appreciate it. All right, this so now all the Veracruz sauce. Now? Okay. Exactly. We're going to let this simmer down just a little bit. Okay. Now, what's in the, the, the Veracruz sauce itself? Well, if you look up, we have uh, corn, it's soft, there's white wine, uh, there's fresh tomatoes and seasonings with it. So it's a nice light sauce. Okay. And are they able to buy that? Yeah, it, it's great that you can make it and make it fresh, but if they were running short of time, can, can they buy that? Yes, uh, you know, you can always come into the restaurant. Anything that we produce there, certainly we do produce it. And we definitely want to, uh, to make sure that uh, we have the product available when they okay. come in, but they can certainly ask for it because it is a very much a, an amazing sauce that they can ask to add to any type of seafood okay. item as right, well, super. too. So everything is looking good there. Now, while that continues to cook, tell me about a couple of the other items that are on, the, uh, on this lighter menu. Absolutely. If you look over here, we have a very nice pork tenderloin salad. Um, that's, or excuse me, the pork tenderloin plate. Uh, it has got a, a polenta with vegetables, fresh vegetables included with that. It also okay. has a whiskey au jus sauce, which mm -hmm. is fantastic uh, flavoring for the meat. Okay. Uh, then we have a polenta appetizer uh, with goat cheese on it and fresh mushrooms, uh, fresh vegetables and corns as well too. And a salmon salad over there. That's a grilled salmon salad that uh -huh. we, we put on it. We have a very nice um, uh, pineapple uh, chipotle vinaigrette dressing okay. that we put onto it as well too and then one of our certainly one of our favorite ones that have been very very popular have been our dessert okay um, the strawberry shortcake that looks good and then when everything is said and done that's what it looks like right there that looks very good and very inviting this is recipe number 5332, and it's online right now in the Talk of the Town section at newschannel5.com. You can try this dish and the other light menu items over at Firebirds Wood Fired Grill, located in the shops at Seven Springs on Old Hickory Boulevard down in Brentwood. So again, thank you very much for being with us it's today. It's my pleasure. Thank you so much.